I want to show you how to post any picture that you would like from your computer or your laptop. I've made a video before explaining exactly how to post anything to your Instagram, but I was using a mobile device at the time. So if you don't know how to post to Instagram, you can find that link right here. But if you want to post from your computer, here is how we're going to go about doing that. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down the bottom so that you never miss a new video from us. And if you liked this or found it helpful, please give me a thumbs up. Okay, I'm logged in here to Instagram with the Carrot Celery Peach Pear account. I'm using Google Chrome. So if you are also using Google Chrome, feel free to follow along. It's a very easy tutorial, but it can look a little bit overwhelming. So let's move through it nice and slow together so that we know exactly how to go about doing this. When you're on Instagram.com, the website, you can see that you can see your newsfeed here and stuff pops up as normal, but there's no clear way to post. You've got your DMs over here. You have posts that have been liked for you and you know all of that kind of notifications and things going on over there. You can certainly see stories, but where do you post from? As it currently stands, Instagram does not let you post from a computer, but there is a back way that we can go around doing this and I'm gonna show you how to do that. So follow along with me if you're using Google Chrome, your steps will be exactly the same. They might look a little bit different, but I'll tell you along the way. So the first thing we're going to do is come across here to this yellow arrow. Now this yellow arrow for you might be instead a set of three little dots, but either way, it's going to be over on this side, on the right hand side. Click that. We're going to go down to more tools wait for that menu to pop up and click developer tools. You can see that there is also a shortcut here. If you wanna press that, get straight to this menu. If you're using a Mac. Once we're in developer tools, it's brought up this extremely overwhelming looking set of codes. Please ignore that. We are not touching any of that. We don't have to go in here. It's not a tricky tip, so don't worry about that. What we do wanna look for is this toggle button up here. It says toggle device toolbar. It looks like a small mobile phone next to maybe a bigger screen, either a computer or an iPad or something like that. We're going to press that and you'll see the second I've clicked that, over here the web page now looks more like a mobile device. It doesn't look like the big web page that we were just looking at. It looks much more manageable and something we're a little bit more used to seeing inside of our phones. At the moment, when I start scrolling, you can't see any sort of posting button or anything like that, but you can see a news feed similar to a mobile device. My mouse has become a circle. It looks like where I would be tapping on something on a phone. All I have to do is come up here and press refresh or command R. And as I do that, you'll see this familiar menu popping up down the bottom, our homepage, our search function, and our post button. So we can now press post from inside our computer as if we were using a mobile phone. If you edit your photos on a laptop, if you use Photoshop, or if you have a bunch of photos already on your computer that you wanna upload, you can do that directly through the website now. You don't have to go through your phone. Okay, so I'm going to show an example now. Let's press that together. You can press plus. And I have this JPEG here sitting on my desktop ready to be posted. I'm going to click that. It is important to note that if you have a PNG file or any other sort of photo file that is not a JPEG, it won't work on the website. So make sure all the files you wanna post are in JPEG format. I can press open and it instantly brings up this very familiar part of Instagram where we can press next, write a caption if we want, and hit share. That has popped up on my newsfeed, which means it has been posted. Let's check it on our profile. There is the photo we just posted together from your laptop using this toggle screen. Something else I wanna show you is that even if you toggle back to the original web page and get rid of this overwhelming looking code, you can see at the bottom now we have home, search, post, heart, and profile, which means all of the mobile functions are now available to you on your Instagram website. If you were to refresh, they disappear and we go back to the original layout of the Instagram website. 
So keep that in mind when you're scrolling. If you press refresh on anything, you're going to have to go back in and toggle back to the mobile version. But that is how you post from your computer.